You're kidding, right? That's a no-go. I like that story. However, going on, we don't have time for it. Hey everybody, I'm Laurie Dew in the Blaze Newsroom. Happy Friday and welcome to another edition of WWDD. A very special day in broadcasting today. This is the day that Barbara Walters officially retired from ABC News. Um, she had a veritable who's who on The View with her today. And we're going to show you a picture of that sort of class shot of all these significant women in broadcasting who came to pay their respects today. I'm not sure why I wasn't invited. <laughs> uh, no, but on a serious note, I have met Barbara Walters a couple of times. Uh, always a thrill. And I wouldn't be sitting where I am today without Barbara because she paved the way for so many of us women in journalism to be able to establish the careers that we have. So, Barbara, I am sure we have not seen the last of you, but we hope that maybe you'll take a well-deserved vacation because goodness knows she needs it. So, all right, moving on. <laughs> Sally, what do you have? All right, this is a story that I loved and it further proves that felines can be just as loyal as dogs. Cats just as loyal as dogs? Yes. Oh, I totally Perfect believe story. that. Yeah. I totally believe it. Yeah, so this was out of California. This little four-year-old was on his tricycle out in the driveway, and the neighbor's dog came out and attacked the little boy and ripped Yikes. him off his bike. And out of nowhere, at lightning speed, came a furball cat. <laughs> <laughs> the family's cat. And it saved his life. You know, I saw this video. It was like it's a amazing. bolt of lightning. <laughs> like the cat was like yeah, a dog. So fast. Yes. Knock the dog right over. Oh, I know. <laughs> yeah. Like mean dog. Get out of there. Yeah. And we love dogs, but that that dog was just mean. Mm -hmm. yeah. Just flat out mean. <laughs> so you know, maybe maybe cat is boy's best friend. Yeah. Who knows? All right. Maybe. Maybe, <laughs> maybe not. All right. I'm stretching yeah, right. it with that. All right, Rach, what you got? My story's not as warm-hearted. Um. There's, we'll put up her mugshot, there's a 34-year-old woman in Texas who was just arrested because she has been posing as a 15-year-old uh, high school sophomore for the last few months. And Ooh. the motive is unknown. <laughs> Why? She got into the, nobody knows. How do you get with that? She got into the school system uh, by getting a guardian at the McDonald's that she worked at because she claimed to this guardian she was 15 and that she was homeschooled and that's why she has no records. So they took her in and they're like, oh, this is great. She had an Instagram that she posted all these things like a 15 year old would. So it was odd. Very, I guess she wanted to relive her high school years. Maybe. I, don't I, really I would know. say maybe she needs to go see a psychiatrast. Yeah, that but might I've be seen the first this step. story everywhere now and it's very interesting. Well, it is. And I hope I hope she gets the help she needs because <laughs> clearly very she needs bizarre. some help. Yeah. Speaking of bizarre, Mike looks a little different today. I lost the weight in my midsection. Yeah, I know. Hi, yeah. Mike. You Hi. look great. Hi. So what, what's going on? Well, this uh, balloon guy is actually a birthday gift from one of the guys here in the office. So happy birthday to Ryan Pierce this week. Happy but birthday, sweet Ryan. sweet is this thing? I just thought oh, this it's, was awesome. It's sweet. It came from the Balloon it's Saloon. Yeah, sweet. it's the really. Balloonsaloon.com. The balloon pay saloon. For. We're not, they're not paying for this. We just think it's so cool. We're giving them free advertising. Free advertising. Yeah. I got to tell you that when I came into work and saw this thing, I must say that my reaction was was um, a bit <laughs> that of surprise and, and shock and awe, yeah. I would say. It was, it's just slightly bizarre. We'll yeah. get Lori one next year. No, yeah. do not get me this, okay? <laughs> like, I feel like I'm going to have nightmares about this thing. Yeah. It's just a little bit off. And it's like, you know, up to here. So. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's life-size. I wore yellow. Yeah. Mike wore yellow. All yeah. right, and now that you think we're really weird, Okay, we are. Have a great weekend. We'll see you next week. <laughs>